Well, I'm the founder of the Ireland's Homeless World Cup Leagues and we have a Homeless World Cup team that's participating in the uh, World Cup in Poland in August. Tonight was a kind of a fundraising match. We're playing the Lewis uh, train. I think that's what I called <laughs> Anyway, we're playing here in the uh, GAA, Parnell's GAA grounds and we hope to raise some money from this event. So that's, that's basically what it's all about. It's unfortunate that it's so warm. I hate to say that, but it is. <laughs> so it makes it very difficult for the players. But we're here and we'll have to accept what conditions we're playing under. So that's the way it goes. Can you give us a bit of background then to the, um, the Homeless World Cup and the Street Leagues? Well, the Homeless World Cup started back in 2003. It was uh, got by the, uh, the International Network of Street Papers got together and they decided that they held an international tournament that would highlight the issue of homelessness and the positive aspects of homelessness and that uh, you know they could see individuals and the potential of the individual rather than just have them stigmatised as uh, you know what their, everyone's perception of them is. So it was a way of really highlighting and showcasing what individuals could do and that's what the initial tournament started. But we noticed when we brought a team over the, the changes in the lads and how they developed and uh, you know, their outlook completely changed and we reckon if we could get a league running in Ireland on a weekly basis it would benefit more people and it would get them uh, uh, so that we could fulfil their potential, get them to feel good about themselves, build their self-esteem and self-confidence and that's what we tried to do and we started off with a pilot scheme in, in Sheriff Street and throughout the years and through a lot of knocking on doors begging for money we now have a couple of leagues running throughout Ireland and each year then we bring a team to represent Ireland, picked from the leagues, to uh, participate in the Homeless World Cup. As I say, this year it's in Poland, so it's, um, there's 48 other nations participating, so it promises to be a very competitive tournament. And do you fancy your chances? Uh, well, it's 48 countries fancy their chances. <laughs> so I'd be no different than them. Uh, it'll be hard. It's like any World Cup tournament, it's very competitive. So, you know, you never know. I'm be optimistic that we'll get to the quarterfinals and then you depend on a bit of luck and maybe if we get the rubber green, who knows. All right, is there anything maybe that you want to say that I haven't asked you? Uh, just that uh, we depend a lot on financial support from individuals and donations. Dublin City Council have been very helpful and the FAI have been helpful, but in these times it's, it's very challenging for uh, all uh, sporting bodies and all charities to try and keep the show on the road. And we're just doing our best. Hence we're here tonight with the charity match. <laughs>